A concept vehicle made by Cedarville University students could cut response time for emergency services. The automated creation would help first responders treat and also transport patients quickly. Today's reporter Sartaj Singh joins us live in the studio. He's digging deeper into how this autonomous ambulance could be the future of emergency response. Sartaj. Cedarville University students, as well as an instructor from the International Center for Creativity, made the concept for the automated ambulance in the matter of just five weeks. This ambulance could drive to the scene by itself, not having to wait for paramedics, providing quicker support to victims at a scene. The future of automation could be heading to emergency services, and Cedarville University students have already envisioned an ambulance that doesn't need a driver. Getting the vehicle without anybody to it, to the scene, is autonomous. Tom Balliot is an instructor for the International Center for Creativity and helped lead Cedarville students to this autonomous ambulance concept. The ambulance would mainly be used in rural areas where response times can be improved when it comes to patient care. The idea would be just like an Uber driver would get a response on their phone, this uh, a paramedic would get a response on their phone saying there's an emergency. The paramedic would then input the location of the scene where the automated ambulance does the rest as it drives itself to the scene to meet with other paramedics to help provide care, whether it's extra supplies or an extra transport option to the hospital. The idea would be as long as there's another responder to drive the vehicle, they could drive them to the hospital. If not, the vehicle could still drive itself to the hospital in an autonomous fashion. This concept made by students still has a long way to go before becoming a reality. Balliot says that this project is presented as a way to support ambulatory services, not replace them. So the idea of this project is not to replace the existing infrastructure that's already in place. This idea is for rural settings where there's vast open areas and response times are difficult. Oftentimes they are volunteer uh, firemen or volunteer paramedics that have to go get apparatus at a station, drive it to the scene. So really the idea here is to reduce that response time. The next step is for a student to either present this as their capstone project or partner with the automotive industry specialist to create autonomous ambulance for presentation. In studio, Sartaj Singh, 2 News.